Well, it was a night of surprises and some upsets at the 76th annual Golden Globe Awards. It sure was. The show kicking off last night in Beverly Hills. Right now, Astrid in the ATL is here with a look at the big winners. Astrid. And Mike, the awards handed out by the Hollywood Foreign Press Association kicked off the entertainment awards season. Take a look. Bohemian Rhapsody, the biopic about Freddie Mercury and the British rock group Queen won Best Dramatic Picture at Sunday night's Golden Globe Awards. Its star, Rami Malek, won his first major award for Best Actor. Thank you to Freddie Mercury for giving me the joy of a lifetime. I love you, you beautiful man. This is for and because of you, gorgeous. Mwah. A tearful Glenn Close urged women to seek personal fulfillment as she accepted the Best Dramatic Actress Award for her performance in The Wife. We have to say, I can do that, and I should be allowed to do that. The heavily favored A Star is Born won only for Best Original Song, Shallow. Green Book, the true story of a 60s African-American pianist, Don Shirley, and his white driver won Best Screenplay and Best Comedy or Musical Picture. Christian Bale delivered an unusual thank you after winning the best actor in a comedy or musical for his portrayal of former Vice President Dick Cheney in Vice. Thank you to uh, Satan for giving me inspiration on how to play this role. Carol Burnet accepted the inaugural award named after her, recognizing outstanding achievement in television. I'm really gobsmacked by this. I does this mean I get to accept it every year? And Jeff Bridges won the Cecil B. DeMille Award for film achievement with a career that spanned six decades, playing ordinary and quirky characters. Uh, you know, if I'm lucky, I'll be associated with a dude for the rest of my life. Andy Samberg and Sandra O oh hosted the show. O oh thanked her parents as she and won I a statue you. for Best Dramatic Performance for All Killing Eve. Regina King won Best Supporting Actress in any motion picture for her performance in If Beale Street Could Talk, while Greenbrook's uh, Marshala Ali took home the Golden Globe for Best Supporting Actor. Roma won Best uh, for Director and Best Foreign Film. I loved Roma. It really is an incredible story about like the invisibles, about people that are usually silenced, and just in such subtle ways, it makes you feel so many things. So you should watch it. Okay, on Roma. Was, it's the black and white film on yeah, Netflix. Yeah, black and white I have foreign not film, but yet. it has you know closed caption in English, so it's, you could keep along. You know. Thanks for the tip and Regina King actually made history or at least said something monumental she said that in her productions she's going to hire at least 50 percent women across the board and encourage other people to, to, to do also. so yeah it's such a male-dominated field Hollywood. absolutely and that's what I love about Glenn Close's uh, uh, you know script as well or her speech that she was just talking about how women we can be anything we don't have to play just one role the nurturer or the wife we have to pursue our own wants as well and we are still a complete female regardless you know yeah. of what path we choose so it was an incredible night for me I love Sandra Oh she talked about representation oh, a great. lot her parents are a whole mood so I love that yep. <laughs> she's always going to be Dr. Christina Yang for me though. Absolutely. from Grey's Anatomy <laughs> yeah. so and Carol Burnett Astrid thank you so much